listening to these two governors, and I was a governor for a long time, tells me your approach is the right approach. You're working with the governors across this country and empowering them to open up as soon as they can safely. Some governors and some perhaps partisans, maybe for election reasons, don't want to have their states open. And then some shouldn't open them quite yet. You know, they're not ready. They went through a lot and they're not quite ready. But no, uh, we're opening our country. People want it open. The schools are going to be open. The president uh, you know, said he wanted he wants schools to reopen this fall. He thinks it's necessary for the economy to recover. He thinks uh, that, uh, that you can't have an economic reopening without schools reopening. Um, and then he believes that the testing and, uh, and other preventative measures that the administration are taking will be enough to ensure that, that schools can reopen even without a vaccine this fall. That is a debatable point given that uh, you know, schools bring in people from multiple households. Um, CDC guidance, uh, uh, it's important to note, does advise uh, that schools envision a very different sort of reopening uh, if they do reopen in the fall, potentially staggering weeks or envisioning short-term shutdowns if family members of, of students or students themselves do test, po test positive. It also uh, envisions surveillance testing. Right now, there's not nearly enough of that in, in the United States to prepare for that sort of eventuality or even envision that sort of scale of reopening. The president is optimistic on that from some of his scientific advisors or maybe a little less so. That's sort of why we've seen a bit of changing in tone from the president and other members of the administration, because they, they're trying to sort of signal um, in terms of what they're saying and how they're saying it, that they don't think this is any longer in, a, in the same sense of urgency or emergency that it was two months ago.